All right, it's a warm morning here in West Michigan. You'd think it's the middle of August, the way we're going to warm things up with this wind today. This is a pretty uh, broad, low pressure system now out over, really centered over Duluth, Minnesota. But the warm front has brought with it a significant pattern change here for the short term. As we did see some showers and even a few thunderstorms early this morning north of Grand Rapids. Now we're in the warm sector of this system and a strong southwest wind is going to be the influence of that warmth. There was another warm front yesterday that moved through. So we went from below freezing Sunday morning into now what will be the 70s near 80 this afternoon. As mentioned, it sets up the winds along the lakeshore today from Allegan up to uh, Mason County. We're going to be seeing wind advisory uh, with gusts over 40 miles per hour at times and uh, wave heights are going to be extensive, well over six, seven feet this afternoon. So we're already seeing winds along the lakeshore gusting over 30 miles per hour in Holland and Muskegon. Sustained winds already over 20 miles per hour as well. Fairly quiet in Greenville and Big Rapids right now, but as that front continues to lift, we are going to see winds ramp up. Generally, we're going to be seeing inland winds gusting upwards of about 40 miles per hour, but again along the lakeshore, be upwards of 45 miles per hour and gradually wind down as the day progresses. But from 10 a.m. today until 6 p.m. is when we have that wind advisory. 70 degrees in Holland, that wind doing a lot to warm us up. 69 in South Haven, 66 in Hastings and Battle Creek. But again, you can see the cooler air, 52 in Big Rapids, 51 in Greenville. That is going to swing significantly in the next few hours as we're going to reach the mid-70s north of Grand Rapids and along the lakeshore and upper 70s near 80 Grand Rapids to the south. So significant warm air moving in. We've already seen our rain for the day. We're going to see a little more sunshine as the day progresses. So here's where the temperatures line up to records. Grand Rapids forecast to beat by 2 degrees. Muskegon, 1 degree short. Kalamazoo, 3 degrees forecast over. And then as well as Holland also a degree over. So significant warmth today and tomorrow as well. But you can see what it does with the winds is allows for major whitecaps on Lake Michigan. So any late season fishing, not a great day for that. Meanwhile, if you can handle the wind, the sunshine is going to be fairly nice. It'll be filtered through some high clouds here today. We'll have cloud cover thicken up overnight tonight. Keeps us really warm. So we're not only talking about record warmth for today and tomorrow afternoon, but also for overnight lows being the warmest. We're only going to get down to the mid 60s. Through the day on Wednesday, we'll have more filtered sunshine. You can see the rain gradually approaching, but as it gets here, it looking like it may fizzle out. So the rain chances for Thursday still there. Bigger story will be the falling temperatures and keeping an eye on the forecast for your trick or treat forecast, which Looks like we're going to be seeing conditions fall back to the low 50s by the time you're trick or treating out there. Temperatures will be in the 50s Friday through the weekend, but 60s expected to come back with more consistent rain opportunities into early next week.